Good afternoon. My name is Bruno Cavalho. I am a PhD student from Federal University of Paraná in Brazil, in the city of Curitiba. My advisor is Mr. Sergio Shear, and we prepare a paper called Analysis and Assessment for Link Construction Adoption in Dog 2. Link construction is a way of design system to minimize waste and generate the maximum volume for your customer and intends to do construction. By implementing link construction in projects, uh, you can reduce your cost, reduce your time, and improve your quality. As everybody knows, Brazil is suffering a big crisis. So now we have a president in charge, and maybe in a short future, he can be fired, but he can, can, can lose the chair. And what happened? Uh, the construction market with these reduced uh, eight percent since the last year and to survive some construction companies uh, they need to do something different and link construction collaborates in this context to generate higher volume for products and service when you compare this to traditional methods of construction i developed a tool called the dog degree of link construction in 2008 in my master thesis and it's pretty much the same uh, what Dr. Pauls showed just before in the last section. And that tool, DOG, was applied around Brazil in 35 different construction companies. And 10 papers were published using that tool. So, with these, we can have an overview about the new construction in Brazil. And when I start to study the numbers and the statistics about my tool, uh, reading the papers, I identify there is a lack of knowledge by the vast majority of the Brazilian contractors on the competitive advantage to be obtained with the applications of the construction. Dog diagnosed the current state of a construction company in relation to the lack of implementation of concepts of the construction that this company had established. Dog was based on the 11 scale principles. I think I don't need to explain this on this kind of conference, but um, uh, the tool was based on this uh, fundamental uh, philosophy or fundamental, uh, how can I say this? Uh, it's a kind of, it's a, the 11 principles, okay? The goal of the dog tool is to point out difficulties found by researchers and contractors in establishing a methodology for the implementation of the new production philosophy. The main question is, how can I start the deployment of the new construction in a company, in a construction company, when the contractor intends to uh, introduce the new construction in his company? The contractors generally do not have a comprehensive knowledge about the current state of their own management, the status in relation to the basic concepts of the new construction, and dog intends to fill this gap. The contractors who apply this questionnaire can map out their strengths and weakness and provide a plan and link construction the dog tool can improve that company with this. Contractors' knowledge about the current, the current situation of their, their own business is critical to setting goals and actions, plans for the future status. And it's assumed that all contractors having their organization's characteristics of link construction, which are applied with a greater or lesser efficiency. But all the companies, they have some of the construction principles. The talk was divided into five questionnaires, and they must all be answered by at least one uh, person representing each of the categories of the stakeholders. Here we have directors from the contractor, field engineers, construction workers, suppliers, and designers. The questionnaire has 204 multiple choice questions, and the rating scale ranks from zero, from zero to three. Level zero means the principle is not present. Level one means the principle is present, but there is some inconsistency. Level two means the principle is present and complete. And level three means the principle is present and with improvements in the last 12 months. The questionnaire will uh, array all principles and all questions equally. So there is uh, the same importance on the questionnaire. 
and the results is obtained through the arithmetic average of the partial results identified among the stakeholders in each of the principles analyzed, and the result is performance uh, in percentage. From 2008 to 2016, 10 papers, as I told you before, were published in 35 different construction companies. And here we have the authors, the different companies where this was applied in the city of this study. All of the study was uh, happening in Brazil because the top two it was initially uh, made in Portuguese, so it was not in English. And as Professor Fritz Gebaut told on Monday, uh, Brazil is a special case. We are in the top three in our GLC, but we didn't found a company with the level A. And I just found a company with the level triple B, uh, six companies with the level double B, and four companies with the level B. That means 31 person with a good level of new construction, and 46 person with low level of new construction, and 23 person with no use or few use of new construction. Here you can have 11 principles of new construction, and the total result of my research um, in the 35 different construction companies. And what you can uh, see on this graph, the principle reduce the cycle time is the least developer with the performance of only 48% of the average among the companies analyzed. And with this, it's possible to identify the need and way for the Brazilian construction industry to develop proposals and actions in favor of new construction. It's necessary to do a double check in this research in the future uh, to see if the, uh, the status of the construction companies or if the status of the Brazilian overview uh, improve or not. And I think this test shows Brazilian companies are fully aware of new construction and are using few new construction practices. And the actions that promote new construction among Brazilian contractors that are not being efficient enough to leverage the country as a benchmark in new construction. If you want to apply the tool, the dog tool, now it's in English, and uh, I provide this uh, in the website, and I hope to get some information around the world and to do a new paper in the future using uh, a different status, but with a worldwide uh, company. So it would be great if you access this and answer the questionnaire with your stakeholders. Thank you.